everybody Ann here and Red Road Homestead. Lena and Guy. Guy, they came to visit me today because they brought property, well, out close to here. So I'm it's very cool. I get to visit with them. <laughs> I'm terrible at like these kind of like introduction things. So I mean I'm not even looking at the camera, am I? It's over there. Right. <laughs> oh well, so say hi everybody. Hi. Talk to you later. Hi. What is it? Little River? Uh, fast, fast, fast River, River. Fast River Little Wolf. Fast River, his uncle's Little Wolf's little my wolf. uncle. Okay, okay, so this is Fast River, and he's going to play us some harmonica. <laughs> Good! Yeah, I would clap, but I'm holding this. I love it. You know what? You're going to have to come out sometime. We're going to have to have a fire, and you can sit and play your harmonica. We'll have Mr. Lucas come over, and he'll he'll bring his Budweiser. Yeah. Right on. <laughs> would you look at these harmonicas? Oh, my goodness. The green one is my favorite. All right. Tell me about these harmonicas. So, I originally got the... Uh... The harmonicas from a, a store in, in Bell Fountain, Ohio called Best Music. Uh huh. And the, the owner's name's Ray, and he's a good guy. And uh, I got the whole set A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. And then uh, I don't have any flats or sharps yet, but all these combs are originally in wood. And I got these acrylic combs from a place called Blue Moon Harmonicas in uh, Clearwater, Florida. So I got the purple. <gasps> Look at that! I got green. Oh, the green is my favorite. I got a uh, bright blue sea. Oh my gosh. Uh, lemon yellow. That's pretty. Orange. Wow. And this one's a pink. And then this is tiger stripes. <gasps> so they take a CNC machine and they have uh, water spraying on it to make sure it doesn't crack. And uh... They go in and they make every single uh, hole for the the key, the notes and everything, right. and they make it to where you can fit the brass reeds in there. And the machine can do like four or uh, more all at the same time. So what I did was I just took it apart right here and right here and pop off the covers. And then you take the little screws out to take the reed plates off. And then I just switched it out, put the reed plates back on, and put the covers back on there. Oh my goodness, that is so, so cool. Alrighty, thank I'll you for sharing that. your uncle and tell him, hey, hey, little wolf, hey, we found Ann. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> So that's how they got all that black dirt on them. <laughs> Look at them. In my lilies. In my lilies. Someone mentioned, I think it was Donna, that I would get so mad at Judy for getting flower beds, but these chickens, I'm just like, oh, how cute. <laughs> I hope you are comfy, girls. There's one more. Oh, she's, she's in the chicken run. Look at these chickens. Good Lord. The fourth hen is trying to incorporate herself into this dust bath. Let's see what happens. Are they going to make room for her? 
Looks like it. Yeah, all four of them. I'll have to do something about this eventually, but I think I just need to dig up some dirt for them that's like the dirt that's down there so that they can have it somewhere that isn't in my lilies. started on these prezzies. I've already opened them. Sorry, I had to. The first one is from Rigby. He sent me a Thomerson heat-powered stove fan, and I opened it up, and I fired it up. I'm going to show you a clip a little bit later of it in action, and it works really, really great. And it, it starts circulating even when I'm just starting the fire so it doesn't have to get very hot for it to work. So this is great, Rigby. Thank you so very much. Heidi, let me put this aside. Now I've taken a couple things out of this. This is from the lovely Miss Donna. She included it in this wonderful bag that I can use for multiple different things. First thing I got to tell you, I already took out. She gave me two big, huge bags of... Um, brown rice so that's in the pantry and I've already been using it and I love it she also sent me some books some activity books that I can use during the winter when it's boring and I have nothing to do but sit inside there's word search which I love three different word search books so let me pull it out yes and another word search Love them. Jumbo size, so I'll be able to see them. Okay, and some trash bags that I needed. And this is particular, particularly wonderful. She sent me two bags of different sized hinges. Look at all of those hinges. Just imagine how wonderful that's going to be. That's going to be to have when I'm doing various projects. All right, Judy, you sniff, sniffing? You smelling? I haven't had enough coffee yet today. All righty, and another bag. Big hinges. This was just such a wonderful idea. I cannot even think of all the different things I can do with these hinges. Wonderful. And she also sent me some more screws. <laughs> Love it. And... Some markers. I'm definitely going to need these markers. Definitely. So thank you, Miss Donna. And I absolutely love this bag. I will definitely get lots of use out of that as well. So thank you. Let me put this all back. She had it packed so nicely. And there's the brown rice that's not in there too. Okay. Now this next one. This is from, let me see. Um, this is from Mary, okay? This is from Mary, and I'm going to tell you, I have already opened this. And, see, there's only three of these left. Look at these. I opened these, and I tried one, and I'm obsessed with them. There were like six or eight of them in there, and there's only three left. These are absolutely delicious, Mary. Thank you so much. There is also a very touching note. I'm not going to read it to you. All I can say is some of you subscribers just really know how to touch me, you know, move move my spirit in a way that brings me so much joy. And I just got to tell you, she shared a couple Bible verses with me. And Mary, Mary, you are just absolutely wonderful. I love you. Thank you so much for this. That note is another one that I will treasure when I'm feeling down. I'm just going to get it out and read it. Okay, and she also sent me pasta salad. I love this stuff. Ranch and bacon. Absolutely do love it. And this, she had talked to me about this. Now, I haven't opened this yet. I'm going to go ahead and take it out of here and show you what it is.
look at this. Now, she had mentioned this a few months ago, and it is jalapeno pepper jelly. I've had this before. I cannot wait to crack this open. This is going to be delicious. I went out and bought some crackers just specifically so I could have this. I can't wait to eat it. I'll tell you what, I'm going to do a taste test in a video so that you can all see me enjoying it and so I can all gloat and say, ha ha, I've got this yummy jalapeno pepper jelly and you don't. Anyway, thank you so much, Mary. And I did want to read one little part of your lovely letter. And in the spirit of hope, 2 Corinthians 4, 18, so we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. For what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. Heavens, yes. God has given you a special life journey, Anne. Walk in faith and with goodness. Let your light burn bright, dear one. You have an amazing opportunity to show your community and YouTubers the testimony of Jesus Christ, for we are clothed in his righteous robes. In Christ, Mary. Okay, I can't even take a picture of my face right now because it would be disturbing, but Mary, that was very, very touching. All of these gifts were touching today, so thank you so very much. Alrighty, I'm going to show you a clip of, well, that fan in operation. I was up pretty early this morning, and I made my coffee on my wood stove, and see the fan there? It is just going around and around and around, and I got to tell you guys, it really does work. These things work. It started oscillating almost right away, takes no electricity, and moves the air throughout this tiny house like you would not believe, so rig me. Thank you so much. This is so awesome. I wanted one of these so bad, and you got it for me. Love you, man. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.